Hi, in this video we'll see how to fix the fire rage. Are you facing some kind of error with fire application which shows rage error and the error is something like this. Okay, so there are different types of errors which you might get or which you might experience while playing the FIAM application. Okay, so however, there is no need to worry for these kind of errors because many users or the many players who are using these kind of applications have come up with some of the solutions like how we can fix this particular error okay because these kind of errors are common whenever you are trying to use some kind of applications or a software not only the FIM application it can be any kind of application or a software okay so in this article we will be going over the reasons that causes the rage error in your system we also see like how we can fix this particular error okay so first we'll see like what are the causes of phiam rage error okay so there can be a few reasons like why you are getting this kind of rage error okay so there is no official or a specific information given by the phiam technical team as why this error occurs however the players have speculated some issues that can be the reason okay so the reason number one is your extended texture budget is high okay so that's the first cause and the second cause is your log files have corrupted files in them so make sure that you are have a original log files and which is not corrupted Okay. And the third cause is the GTA V game files could have broken. Okay. So make sure that your files are not broken and your files are not corrupt. So this can be avoided by using the latest or updated version of GTA. Okay. And the fourth cause is your graphics driver is not updated to its latest version so here you can see the type of the error which you are facing how to fix the pym rage error too okay so here you can see the rage error and here you are getting some kind of error like game memory error please reboot and restart the game okay so now let's see like how we can fix these kind of phiam rage okay. so the first method is turn down the extended texture budget the first thing that you can try is to turn down extended texture from the graphic settings of the game the rage error might be happening due to high graphic settings of phiam so many players will be able to solve this rage error when they turn the extended budget texture budget settings to low. So go to the settings of that particular gaming application and make sure that the to lower down the uh, texture budget. Okay. Suppose if you are having the higher texture budget like make sure that to make it to the then you will come out of that particular problem or the error okay that's the first method like how we can fix this particular problem and the second method is delete the log files the next thing what you can do is to delete the log files from the files of PyM application so what you have to do is like go to the icon of phiam application on the desktop right click on that particular icon okay then open the file location so once you open the file location go to the phiam application data okay 
So once you go to the FIAM application data, select the log file. So once you select the log file, delete the files inside the log file. So once you enter the log file folder, so delete all the files inside the log files. That's the second method. And the third method is verify GTA game files. You should also verify the game files of GTA because if there is any issues uh, where the files have got corrupt or broken, then verifying them would have helped them to solve this particular issue. So we'll see like how we can uh, verify the files for this. So if you have purchased the game through an epic, then go to the library, then select GTA V, then click on the three dots and choose verify. Okay, that is the step to verify the files for epic. And now we'll see like how we can uh, verify the files for Steam. If you have bought a GTA V in Steam, then go to the Steam library, then right click on GTA V and select properties from the options available. Then go to the log files tab and then verify the integrity of game crashes option to verify the files. Okay, and now we'll see like how we can verify the files for GOG. If you have gotten GTA from GOG.com, then launch GOG Galaxy on your system or device, then log into the account. Then find GTA V and then customize, then go to customize. So once you go to customize, you can see the manage installation option. So once you click on that, you can get the option like verify or repair to verify and repair the files. That's the third method. Okay. and now we'll see like uh, the fourth method like how we can fix this particular error so that can be done by updating the graphics driver so this is the one of the reason like why you are facing this particular error you need to regularly update your graphics driver so that they can play the game properly if you're not updated the graphics driver you know the in your system then please check the official website then see whether if there is any update available okay. if you see any update then install then you should not be able to see this particular error again so the error will be fixed once you update the graphic graphics drivers and that's the fourth method and the fifth method is contact the FIAM support team the FIAM support team always ready to help you they will be ready to help you and they will come up with the solutions for the problems which you are facing so this is the particular website cfx.rd that is support.cfx.rd so once you go to this particular website here you can see submit a request so click on that and here you can select help and support so here you can enter your email id here you can enter the subject for the error you are facing here you can enter, mention the entire description for the error you are facing so before submitting make sure that you have taken a screenshot of the error what you are facing suppose this is the screenshot of the error what you are facing take the take that screenshot file save it somewhere in your system then finally you can attach that particular file here okay then once you attach the file make sure that you have entered your email id correctly then finally you can submit it then you can wait for some time because the backend team will see the problem what you are facing they will come up with the solution and they will get back to you they will help you to fix this particular okay that's the fifth method like how we can overcome this particular problem okay so that's all about this thank you